got to go to T-Mobile, which is reporting third quarter results. Ashley Webster has those numbers. Ashley. Yeah, Melissa, T-Mobile calling it the best financials ever and strong customer growth getting right to it. The uh, earnings per share coming in at 93 cents. That's better. As you can see, the estimate of 85 cents revenue at 10.8 billion. That beats estimates. That is up 8 percent. That service revenue also up 6 percent. But I want to talk about very quickly the customer growth. 1.6 million total net addition, says T. Mobile. That's the 22nd consecutive quarter with more than 1 million net additions. And you can see after hours up 3.5%. Some very strong results from T Mobile. Yeah. Those look good. All right, good stuff, Ashley. Thank you. Let's get some instant reaction to that number now. This is the first on Fox interview. The president of T-Mobile is here, uh, Mike Sievert. Now, any time that you could say, sir, that you have your best financials ever, obviously that's good. Your stock's reacting with a positive after-hours move, as Ashley says. You're smiling. Let me start with the customer growth figures. You come in at 1.6 million on that customer growth figure. What can you tell us about the next quarter and next year in terms of key growing that customer base. Well, Connell, I think what the numbers show is that we are delivering an all-time record performance across the board in this company. Our growth is accelerating. Those numbers are up on pulse-paid growth year over year and quarter over quarter. So that gives us a lot of confidence in the business going forward that we're delivering on all cylinders. I'm so proud okay. of the team. This was a blockbuster quarter. Company-specific issues that are driving all of this. I know you're trying to work out the Sprint merger, which I want to ask you about in a second. Or is the macro environment also contributing to it, the economic environment? Well, it's a really competitive marketplace out there. You know, with the new launches of new phones, everybody was playing hard this quarter. But in a sense, it doesn't matter. You know, we have delivered the market-leading growth 22 quarters in a row in every competitive circumstance. And that's what's enabled us this time to deliver all-time record service revenues, all-time record EBITDA, and a number of postpaid phones that we think, get this, will be the number uh, that's more than AT&T, Verizon, Sprint, Comcast, and Charter, Combined. Oh, well, it's well, tough to argue with that. Now, let me uh, get a question in on how this merger is going to work out with Sprint. There are obviously some challenges there as you look to the future. I was looking at the New York Post headline about the New York Attorney General, the new Attorney General we have here in New York State, stepping up an investigation of that merger, concerned that there would be price hikes on some of the cheaper prepaid services. What, if anything, can you tell us about that? For example, can you assure us that there won't be if consumers are watching and wanting to know? Well, Connell, what this boils down to is a new T-Mobile that will bring more competition to the marketplace than ever before. We've submitted 25 million pages of records to the government at every level mm -hmm. and written a thousand pages of economic analysis and arguments. And it's a complicated story, but what it boils down to is pretty simple. The massive synergies of this merger will allow us to create a network with unprecedented capacity, right. and that capacity will allow us to bring more competition and lower prices lower to every prices. American. Lower prices. And we think it's going well. You know, in the end, the government's going to look at all that analysis, and I think the facts will lead them uh, to, to understand that this is about more competition and lower prices for uh, all Americans. Okay, so you just to hammer the home that point to, as a quick um, final point on this. Lower prices, not higher prices, is what you're saying. You're assuring consumers. That's right. That. All right. Um, thank you, sir. Congratulations on the numbers. Thanks for coming on. Thanks a lot. My pleasure.